Minnesota's primary election that was held on Tuesday had a, the largest turnout in nearly 24 years. The turnout was especially significant for Democrats, who nearly doubled the turnout of Republicans. About 902,000 of the state's registered 3.2 million voters cast primary ballots. More than 582,000 of those voters cast ballots for the DFL. But the large turnout for Democrats doesn't have Republicans worried. I think we're very confident moving into November. You know, turnout in at the caucuses or in the primary, for example, it's important to a degree, but it's not the end-all be-all. And the Democrats, we've seen them have higher turnout just consistently this cycle, and I don't think that necessarily means anything. When you go back and look at 2016, President Trump won 78 out of Minnesota's 87 counties. He came within one and a half points of winning this state for the first time for Republicans since 1972. And all that I've seen as I've gone around Minnesota is the momentum for our president continues to remain really, really high. And that trickles down to all of our candidates. The total number of voters was the highest in a state primary election since 1982. If you enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax-deductible contribution to Lakeland PBS.